Let's solve this abstract algebra question. So my set is Z10, which contains the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And those are the remainders that you will get when you divide any whole number by 10. So that's how we um, find the number that corresponds. So for example, if the number is 21, that's going to correspond to the number 1 because the remainder of 21 when you divide that by 10 is 1. Okay, so we want to find when x is equal to x to the 5th. So we're going to list the numbers from x to 10, and we're going to take it to the 5th power. So 1 to the 5th power is 1. 2 to the 5th power is 32, which has a remainder of 2 when you divide that by 10. 3 to the 5th power is 243, which has a remainder of 3 when you divide that by 10. 4 to the 5th power is going to have a remainder of 4 when you divide that by 10. 5 to the 5th power is going to have a remainder of 5. And what you'll notice is that for each one, the remainder will be whatever the value of x is. And of course, if you put 10 in there, you get, z you get a 0 at the end, which means 10 divides into it. So that corresponds with 0. And by the way, 10 is the same thing as 0, if you're wondering. So what happens here is that every single number in this set, z10, from 1 to 10, it works for. So it works for every single number in the set. Isn't that pretty cool?